welcome back to another Walmart Wednesday. That's right, I'm back, and these are gonna be weekly again. I'm over here in the school supplies aisle, as you guys can see. It's that time of the year again. Walmart starts having out their, their, um, yeah. Walmart starts having out all their school supplies stuff. And look at what I found here. Let's see, the new Ninja Turtle stuff. Actually, let me flip this over. I'll be right. Yeah, the new Ninja Turtles stuff. But look at this. <laughs> that brings me back to my school of the days. So is that with Trapper Keepers? Just the way those are designed. Those retro looks for them. Ooh, that, that's, that's pretty nice. This turtle set has like notebooks and a binder right there. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's a cool set. I wish I had sets like that when I was a kid. Binders, you never know what, when you may need a binder to keep your logs of all your movies in. So, right there. I know, I use an app. But right there is all the school stuff. Right there is Barbie related. So, since Barbie's going to be a huge movie before school starts, there you go. More zipped up trapper keepers and stuff like that. Oh, right over here. This is what I was looking for with posters. See if there was anything awesome school related posters i mean we got an awesome godzilla right there look at that that's cool we have super mario brothers movie right there we got the mandalorian we got the world that godzilla one's actually pretty tight oh and we have down here if you see here we got nightmare before christmas there's a godzilla one again there's five nights at freddy's there's what is it are you for your right there? I think I mispronounced it. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's a phrase right there. We have Minecraft. Right there. Oh, there's Barbie. There's Barbie. And Spider Man. I'm a Pokemon. And the greatest basketball player to ever play the game. Right there. <laughs> I mean, like I was saying earlier, it is an impressive day when we go and have school starting back up again. You never know what type of deals you might get because they have to clear out rooms. They have to clear out areas here in Walmart to make room for the school supplies. So you never know what might be clearance. And that's where we're going today is the clearance rack. So just cutting through like towels and bedding, stuff like that to get over to my clearance aisles. We're almost over there. Going through stuff you guys can see the pricing on certain things. Need a vacuum cleaner for $59? Yeah, that's pretty good. Let's see. We're almost over there right now. Almost there. Almost there. And right here is our clearance. Let's see what we have over here. Some light year stuff. Doggy Danas. Mandalorian. Mandalorian. Glasses with a uh, blue light glasses. Oh, that's cool. Want some ice cream? But, um, yeah. Looking at some stuff, we got ice pop makers. More reading glasses, light year. So nothing really, it looks like toy-wise in here, but you never know when you may need a coaxial cable. <laughs> Monster six foot audio cable. That's not a bad price for seven bucks. Yeah. So look at silicone molds. Oh, what kind of forever a drawstring backpack for, for five bucks. I mean, that's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. Oh, there's a big Coke bank. It's a Coke bank. That Coke bank is not on clearance. It has no clearance price on it. Could figure it out in a moment, though. Let's see. We have over here some Lightyear stuff. A bunch of Lightyear stuff. I mean, right down here we have a Monopoly game for 15 bucks. Yeah. I'm not seeing. Ah, oh, you see the Magic X. And it's Lightyear, though. Like I was saying, a bunch of light year stuff over here, SpongeBob. But nothing worth 
my time and energy to actually look through much more. And oh, need gaming pads? Because this is a desktop. This is a desktop mouse pad, so they're the bigger ones. How much are these? 350, 354. Those gigantic mouse pads. Not a bad price. Not a bad price. Iron on letters for shirts. Yeah, like I was saying, there was really nothing in the clearance section today, so check yours, because I know clearance-wise things are different in each store, so check your check your local stores for those. But right now we're going to a couple of spots where I know it's usually the same in all stores. <laughs> so what we're going to do is this. We're going over to the toys first. We're gonna go over the toys, go and check out there, see if there's anything awesome there. Um, yeah. Hot, I, ooh, I see Hot Wheels. See Lego Ninjago. I'm just gonna walk down this out and just see if there's anything. If there's anything worthwhile, I'll record it for you guys. Nothing down that first aisle, but right over here we got Little Mermaid and Disney Princess stuff. But right here is not all the action action figures. So we got By Nights of Freddy's Pet Simulator, Minecraft. Just walking down among us, Super Mario Bros. A lot of this stuff is actually a lot of this stuff is ten bucks. Pretty awesome, Shy Guy. Gotta love Shy Guy. Oh, that's cool. Little Mario Racer. Bakugan is still out. Wow. Remember when Bakugan was a big thing? Beyblade. Fortnite. Oh, Power Rangers. We got Dino Fury. We got the Mega Fury Saber here. Mighty Morphin White. Right there. Check your Walmarts. You guys can get some White Ranger Power. You get. In space pink, zeal yellow. You got lightning collection there. You get a zeal cog. That's cool. Now it's not very rare. It's very rare you get the villains. Mesagog. It's very rare you get the villains in there. There's some GI Joes. Those little brawling boots type of things there. We get. Some WWE figures here. Some more modern, up to date WWE figures. Got the Rita Ripley right there. Uh, you know, here, here. There's something. There's something. Should I buy this? Should I buy this and convert it into my Walmart onesie? It already has two W's on it. Should it become my Walmart onesie. Tell about. Let me know in the comment section below. Should that become my my Walmart onesie belt? We have Edge right here. Yeah, we got tag team Intercontinental and another tag team. About we got some Masters of the Universe. We got Wardlow, Powerhouse Hobbs, Brian Cage, MJF, Bray Wyatt. Like I said, more Masters of the Universe. Ooh, classic Star Trek figures. If you guys, guys, check out your WalMarts. You guys get to see some classic Star Trek stuff. Hold on, let me, let me take a picture of this. This is gonna be my new thumbnail for today. All right, I took a picture of it. Yeah, you see Star Wars Rivals right here for clearance. You also have the classic phaser there. Hey, hello there, Obi-Wan. So, some awesome Star Trek stuff on clearance right now so we're just gonna come over here we go here we got pokemons 
We can see some smaller DC stuff. These these old school lines of superpowers that are more so the more modern day stuff is actually pretty cool. There's the Batman who laughs, John Stewart Green Lantern. What do you guys think of Nathan Fillion becoming Guy Gardner? That makes me wonder how old John and Hal are going to be. But that brings up an interesting point for that. These are awesome. You get a comic book in with a little figure. So that's cool. That's Flashpoint. What this movie was supposedly based off of was this. So we go there. So yeah, some other ones. The Superman one is a oh, rebirth. This one, ah, right there. Batman 608. That's a good one. So right over here, we got these other McFarlane ones. I have this Batrocitus right here. Superman one's missing a leg, but I have a Batrocitus. You guys want to see, comment down below. You guys want to see me put some of my figures up on a shelf out, out of the box and create like a little display for them? Let me know down below if you guys want that. I'm thinking about it anyways, but I want to do it as a video if you guys want to see it. There's X-Men. I love that they're doing some more Marvel Sirens. Uh, this is Bone Breaker. Well, that's Siren. They make up Bone Breaker, and there's Bone Breaker, which is kind of a cool mutant because Bone Breaker is part tank. <laughs> Look at that again. Bone Breaker is part tank. You get Wolverine, Marvel Siren, Marvel's Havoc, Marvel's Falcon, Maggot, uh, Darwin, and Sabretooth. Which is funny because Havoc. Banshees and Havocs looks almost look like that in the comic books. Bonebreaker is a tank. That's pretty funny. So we have that one and we have Vulcan right there who makes the same thing. Yeah. Those ones, those ones are pretty cool to build your own figure. I don't see anything else, any of those elsewhere around. But we're getting to dinosaurs now. Dinosaurs. And there's a mask I had once. Someone says, oh, I should, I should buy it and wear it. Maybe. But these, these are kind of cool. The original 1989 figures, the way they look. The original 1989 turtles. That's actually pretty dope. It's pretty awesome. Or how about these guys? Like, these take me back. I mean, seriously, Pisa, Pisa Toss and Mikey. I had that one at one point in time. There's Casey Jones. There's some other Pizza Toss and Ralph. Rafe. Um, there's Raphael right there. Mikey in disguise. Leo in disguise. There's Mikey. There's Leo from the movies. Those are actually pretty awesome too. We get Transformers Rise of Beast here. That's a pretty misunderstood movie. That movie was actually pretty good. I was shocked by that. Oh, uh, we get Legos, Infinity Gauntlets, 70 bucks, yeah, that's 70 dollars for that one, but yeah, a little expensive, we got Mike, we got the Batman bike right down there, we got that one thing from Thor, we got right down there the office, for all you office fans out there who watch, there's the office, check your, right there too, Galaxy Explorer, there's that ship again. I, I'm i starting to get into these guys. Not necessarily these flowers ones. But more of these sets that are like, yeah, hey, here's a set. It's not actually a play set. It's just a set to put out and just have it be there. There's a new Guardian ship. There's the Avengers Quinjet. Some really awesome stuff Lego-wise here. Um, we get Max, Pokemon, Monster Trucks, and I'll turn around to see this set of Legos. So come back down over here. We got light here down below on clearance. Look at all that. BTS right there. BTS right there. Like I said, Harry Potter. Like I said, guys, check your local Walmart. Your toys look like a bunch of toys are on disco right now. So you guys might be able to get some great stuff. I'm looking down here. Those cars. Dom's Fast and Furious car right there. Uh, Star Wars NASCAR. Here's the Captain Rex, Commander Cody, the Mandalorian, Emperor's Throne Room right there. 
um, <laughs> Boba Fett stone room. But if you're more into like the sets that just stand there, here's one that could just stand there right there. The Executor Superstar Destroyer. And how about this one up here? Luke Skywalker's Land Speeder. That's pretty cool. We got the Death Star Trash Compactor right there. Got the Indoor Super Chase right there. Those are these, like I said, these ones here are pretty cool. Pretty cool sets. Yeah. So yeah, like I was saying, check out your Walmart because even Nerf is on clearance. So yeah, even check out your local Walmart, ladies and gentlemen. See what's on clearance. We got some puzzles here. Uh, Thomas Kincaid, uh, Justice League. That's actually pretty awesome right there. Oh, we get Wolverine. How excited are you that we're actually going to see this costume in Deadpool 3? Probably without the mask. So I'm fine without the mask. We got that. We have Kenobi and Vader. Star Wars puzzles. Yeah, so we got some decent puzzles and everything stuff like that so games like card games are on clearance yes. monopoly trap monopolies are on clearance too so check your local walmarts as a gentleman for clearance i know i know you guys watch this for my movies but it's clearance day today at walmart so check it out <laughs> so check it out lot of good stuff around and you want to know something it wouldn't be a Walmart trip without a huge Barbie display yeah look at that it's huge and it's double-sided yeah <laughs> yeah that's funny so what I'm gonna do is gonna go over in the movies really quick see what's there and I'll be right back kind of love these I kind of love these guys these slips kind of glad that they're getting into more blu-rays with them too than anything else it was like i have this tv show do i want the slip it looks cool i'm gonna just game see sue's out six movie collection for scream if you don't already have them that's a good one there <laughs> the blu-rays here they're out of one thing there there's the blu-ray for scream six. Oh, i will that cover art is actually pretty cool for that book club the next chapter more blu-rays of john wick big george foreman pope's exorcist they still have a 4k of dungeons and dragons out here hmm right there that's actually pretty awesome Go over here huh 4k of 65 still out with adam driver renfield is here shazam come on release the blu-ray pack that way i don't want to buy it online but more Dungeons and Dragons, Yellowstone, Creed. Yeah, that slip's kind of destroyed, but we've got a three Creed, three, four K right there. But yeah, so we go in here for some movies, TV shows. So we have here The Covenant, and we have Big George Foreman just sitting around there. And it's typically almost complete series. It's not complete if you're missing a season along with a couple movies. But yeah. And over here, see. Part two of Justice League Ruby is coming out soon. Uh, yeah. Just do some stuff that's out right there. Check out my Netflix, what Netflix could do with this section video right here. Check that out. Donuts collection. I like this display. Oh, there's Mickey. It's out now in stores. The Mickey and Friends Volume 2. Mickey and Minnie. Yeah. Right over here with some other stuff. Scooby Doo, Looney Tunes, Matrix, John Wick. Just gonna go slow over here so you guys can see what's over here. Cocaine Bear is still here. Silent Night is. Violent Night, I'm sorry, is there. Just now with slips, and I don't really care. <laughs> but right there. So, we'll go check the main out and camp a little bit, but first, there's some clearance in here too, so, gotta check here. 
Let's see. We get here's the toys. What's this kiss thing? Signature colors. Oh, they're four figures. That's pretty cool. There's Dr. Fate. I have this one now. Supergirl from all from Injustice. I like these guys. I like these guys here. Joker, Flash. Oh, Dr. Zoom, I'm sorry. Professor Zoom, Roy first Flash. Nightwing figure here. Pretty cool. This is from Gotham Knights. It's from the Gotham Knights video game. That's pretty cool. So that's relatively a newer one. Spawn down there. We got Funkos. So nothing on sale. Nothing worthwhile. There's the protectors. Dinosaurs, huh? Empties. I mean, so here is. Relatively empty, but it's Firefly and Blu ray. It's a big series. I have to double check to see if I actually know I have a DVD. So should I upgrade for 14? The Reluctant Dragon. This is a classic Disney one. The Reluctant Dragon. These are a bunch of shorts. Right there. Goliath 2, Fernand the Bold, and Johnny Appleseed. For 750? Can't go wrong with stuff like that. But the TV stuff is not there. I'm kind of sad, but we're gonna go this way and look at some of the other other stuff. Look at that fan. A selfie lights. And then we look over here. There's Black Manta. Oh, there's. Just anime series. There's Roman Reigns. Okay. And over here some video games. And now we're gonna go. Well, that was it. That in that front and cap was just a little depressing. I'm shocked my wife, so Walmart doesn't have that fillet. She's, this was normally very good at that. The, that's where I'm at, the one where my wife works. She's not working today, she's off. But anyways, a lot of clearance stuff at Walmart. So it's, like I said, it's school time. So a lot of stuff they had to throw back on clearance because they had to make way for school supplies. Like, as you can tell, a lot of school supplies. But anyways, I just want to say I'm back. It's glad to be back here. I have a couple other videos I have planned. I have another criteria. I have some criterion stuff that came in. Some expression criterion video for me. Maybe next week. Yeah, next week sometime. You guys follow me on my socials. You guys know I'm part of a podcast network called Bloodline Entertainment Network where we talk wrestling, sports, and entertainment. Well, I just yesterday I did a review on Sound of Freedom if you haven't seen that movie it's a very good movie go, go see it it's gonna open up your eyes to a whole world of stuff that you may not even know exists in this world today but I do movie reviews like that I do other things like that I'm on streams with them I talk I do shorts of breaking news and stuff like that and on Sunday, I'm going to be starting a new little segment on that network called Coming Attractions, where I do trailer reviews. So stay tuned for those. But anyways, here on my channel, right here on Bin Buster, a couple more Criterion videos coming out when my orders start coming in. One came in. I'm waiting on another one from Macari. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'll go to my Best Buy. My um, Barnes & Noble, sorry, Barnes & Noble. But that one, my Barnes and Noble is weird with their physical media. I don't know even know if they would have a criterion section like most of them do. I don't know. I will have to check that out. But if it's a decent section, oh. even if it's not a decent section, I'll show it to you guys. But one more Wednesdays are back. I'm. I have a couple of videos coming out that I saw film about 
different things. I have a live stream coming up at the end of this month. I got re a rewind coming out this month. So be on the lookout for those. Be on the lookout for a lot more stuff coming on my channel. It's just, I've been on vacation and I need to continue working on some of this stuff. So until next time, I'm Ben Buster. Grabbing some tea. I'll see you guys later. Have a good one. Bye.